some Brussels with love. Bonjour! But anyway, like how cute is this? Then I told him you treat me so well. He said, Can't shop for sale. Matter of fact, scratch that. I'ma see what's that. Just cause you fine as hell. And I told him, Well, thank you, babe. Anything for my favorite lady. Well, I gotta go. They just let me know. Wow. I got hoes. Hello, hello, Daddy. Oh, wow. I call and they drop the low. I'm gonna be like this. Bow, 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 bow. I'm kidding. I don't know if they be dancing like that out here. She gon' give you life. So stay down and right the way. Perfect piece of heaven. It can go no other way. Giving you heaven on earth. Giving you heaven on earth. Giving you heaven on earth. Lakewood means rewind, a gunshot means forward. You requested it, so we re How much is calling kids to play? I might just come see you today. You wait, I'm stuck up in my ways. But love it when I'm playing games. That's the only way we get away. We stuck together. You must forever. crazy mind you i left so many things in the states but yeah waiting on my uber right now and yeah it's currently raining I'm waiting on my uber Hello. how are you Good. So, the place that I went to, first off, the Uber dropped me off at the wrong place. Walked in there and then I went to the right place, which is down the street. Why did the kitchen close? It's 1024. The place that they close at 1130. But the kitchen is already closed. So they referred me to go somewhere down the street called Mono Mono. Um, I originally was trying to go to Volta Supper Club. I'm very sad because it honestly looks so good. But let's see what is down the street. Mono Mono. 
Let's look at the menu. Ooh, it actually looks pretty darn good. It's just not what I was expecting though. Um, uh, sigh. So note to self, you cannot leave and go somewhere to eat last minute. I'm just like, what do I do now? I'm like, should I just go get a burger from this other place and then go back to this pizza spot the next day? Because I'm telling you the desserts and stuff looks so good here. So I think I'm gonna do that. Oh gosh, okay, we'll see. I'm gonna let you guys know what I end up doing. So I asked for a sweet wine, y'all. This is not sweet and I've only, I've had like three sips and I'm already like, I'm feeling it. But you know, just vibes, just vibes. <laughs> I don't know if I'm this grown enough yet. I don't know. But you know, I'm here for the experience. Thank you, Lord, for our daily bread. In Jesus' name, we pray. Y'all, I'm drunk in Belgium. I'm drunk in Belgium. All right, let me stop for a day. There's something wrong with me. But y'all, why I got this damn bodysuit on with these Yeezy pods? I feel like a ninja. Like I literally feel like a ninja. Luckily I have blonde hair, but god damn, I feel like a ninja. Like I'm creeping through the fucking crevices. Okay, they probably think something's wrong with me. But I'm looking for a little shed, just so I can stand under until I call a Uber. Um, um, I don't see any. Oh gosh. Oh, I can go right here. Tomorrow, I'm gonna wake up bright and early and I'm gonna go shopping for new clothes and stuff because I need new clothes for out here. But anyways, I gotta call Uber, so ciao for now. The next day. No one, me trying to order a acai bowl on Uber Eats. Um, I know what some of them mean. This is strawberries. Um, I feel like that's really all that I want, but I'm like, I want to Google every word so I can actually know. Let me see. Is there any meal? Oh, yes, there we go. See, okay. Um, this apparently that's I do want light that's um evaporated condensed milk. Um, fruit de la passion. Let's see. Fruit, fruit, day, passion fruit, day. Why did I not think of that? Um, I don't want passion fruit. I think I would like to add some kiwi. Um, I forget what Amanda was. Oh, almond. I think that's all, honestly. I don't see any yogurt, so we're gonna do that. This is my order, and we'll see what it comes with. not 
a fan. I'm not a fan of this site. I'm just eating the fruit around it, but I don't know if I'm just used to artificial flavors and stuff like that from the States or what it is, but it just has like a distinctive different taste. But I'm not bashing like, you know, Brussels food or anything. I'm just saying like, I'm not used to this flavor. <laughs> I tried this on, but I liked it, and then this. So I like this. I feel like I would need a black hat, and my Yeezy pods would be cute. Um, this, I'm not too sure if I like this. I think this is so freaking cute and dainty. Like, how cute is this? She's so cute. This was pretty cool. Never seen this before. <laughs> Thank you. And see, that's what I want. This is so pretty. Yeah, of course. It's already filming. It's already filming. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna press. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's cute! <laughs> I have a lot of shit in my hand, though. <laughs> Thank you. You're you're welcome. So freaking pretty, it's a Rolex store. I want that one right there. That is the one that I want. Okay. Just in case you guys see my man, y'all want to tell him for me. That one. That one. I need a Rolex day date. Um, either I'm gonna buy it myself or it'll give me a gift. Preferably buy it myself, but you know, I'm always accepting pretty gifts. Okay, okay, okay. So okay. I'm taking my photo myself. Now go take me a photo. Now go myself. Okay. So you take me a photo. Yeah. So you take me a photo. That's how you He's funny. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. What's your name? Bonjour, bonjour. Heaven. My name is Heaven. Yeah, like heaven. heaven on earth. Okay. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Huh? Thank you. What? Come on, she's still a 
been drinking dry wine this entire time. Like I'm an adult. Or like I'm French or Italian or something. Oh my gosh. I like also to film my photos. America. In different area codes. Everywhere I go, I call and they drop the low. Cause I got hoes. In different area codes. Some of them I'm out of the way with Pablo. This nigga swear that he'll chop up. He know how to play in my face. I swear it's hard for me to keep my calm, huh? He be tweaking cause he in my vato. In his pockets like I had the lotto. I'ma get to this money and fuck these niggas. That's forever the motto. Mercy Foku. Mercy Foku. That means thank you so much. Mercy Foku. Mercy <laughs> Bonjour. Good morning. Bonjour. Good afternoon. I got y'all. Dark corn. Okay. You got desires, I know, I know. You got desires, I know, I know. You got desires. Look at that vibe. You know that vibe. Look at that vibe. Sugar, period. Stand on that.
the next day. So I got a couple things from Zara. I got this top, it's like a tube top. I got these beautiful earrings. I really just wanted some like, these look, they look very antique and I just wanted to be like, yeah, I got these in Belgium. And these look like something you can be like, I got them in Belgium. Okay, I don't know why I said Belgium, but yeah. And then I got this cute leather jacket. It's a crop jacket. I love the way it fits me. And then this cute, I just love this dainty like skirt like this. So freaking cute. It's a dress. And then the back. Now let's hear it for the back of the dress. But yeah, that's the back. I think this is so freaking cute. I'll probably end up wearing either this tonight with gold jewelry or I'm going to wear this with these um, flared brown pants that I have. We'll see which looks better, but I am going outside tonight. <laughs> Let's hear a round of applause. I'm kidding. I was just kind of outside last night, but I wasn't outside. Like tonight I'm actually going to like a nightclub and stuff so we can get the real vibes of Brussels, Belgium. But yeah. And actually I'm doing a new series where I am spending time with a baddie in another country just so we can see how their lifestyle is in another country so tune into that video right now right after you finish watching this vlog but tune into that video right now and i think it's gonna be so so fun i don't know if this one is gonna go exactly how i want but each video of that series will get better and better because this one i had it planned out but we are like it's kind of getting a little unplanned now so yeah i think yeah yeah because at first i really wanted us to like go to lunch i wanted to ask questions and stuff but it's also a language barrier so it's probably going to be even a little tougher so anyways yeah we'll just get there when we get there but yeah see y'all tonight so faithful oh my god y'all my camera's about to die then i bring a charger but but I'm trying to rush all these words out before I get to what I'm saying. So I'm back at where I came yesterday for that pizza. It was so freaking good. But I came with friends yesterday that I had just met. And today I'm coming alone. So yeah, I'm about to just edit on my phone. Edit this next YouTube video that's coming out. The 72 Hours in Atlanta vlog. And um, yeah, so. Oh, I came here for the pizza, like I said. Why does it not? The pizza is not served until 6 o'clock, y'all. It's 4.54. And another thing, Belgium is not famous for their wine. They're famous for their beer. I'm not a beer person. Like, I just can't get jiggy with that shit. But this red wine has been going crazy for me, literally. And honestly, I'm not even a dry red wine person. I'm normally like a sweet red wine, but they don't have sweet reds. So I've literally been, I feel like such a grown up because I've literally only been drinking dry wine. <sighs> the life of a Belgian girl. Oh my gosh, y'all look crazy. But everyone in Belgium is so sweet. I don't, actually, let me not say that. That is not true. Everyone in Belgium is not sweet. But there's a lot of sweet people here that I meet. And I've been having a blast. Literally, solo travel. Love it. Like, I love it, solo travel. But the only thing is I'm so tired from like traveling and stuff that I can't really like extend my like energy for real like I want to. Like everything that I'm doing, I feel like I'm forcing myself. Like I literally just want to be in the bed slumped. That's literally all I want to do. But I'm like, I'm in Europe and I'm only here for a certain amount of days. Like, let me just have a ball. <sighs> the life of a belgium girl okay i'm sorry that's gonna be in my head the rest of the vlog it just started literally like the la the first time i said it and but now i love it the life of a belgium girl okay bye up from my nap i honestly could have slept longer but i'm about to go out my last hoorah Actually, I don't want to say the last. Probably be out tomorrow, but it's time for a hoorah. Let me get ready. 
I need to like throw water on my face or something because oh my gosh. But yeah, okay. Water tea because my throat has been hurting ever since I hit someone's vape. Shake my head. But almost done with my makeup. Yeah. I left my mascara at home, so I'm literally using a dark eyeshadow and a Q-tip to make something shake. Speak breakthrough in my finances as you guide me to be a good steward of the resources you have entrusted to me. Help me to experience your supernatural provision. I pray for breakthrough. Hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't want to be that was a really great prayer my aunt actually sent me this prayer today she called me and she said heaven i'm sending you this prayer you need to recite this prayer every day of may and i'm very upset because it's may 4th but it's okay never too late <coughs> but as i was praying it it's a great prayer it's really a great prayer it has so many scriptures included inside of it as well and also just a prayer speaking scriptures of your life you're just literally speaking the word of god over you like prayer is one thing but the word of god is another and both combined is literally just amazing um i will leave the link to this prayer below in the description box if you are as well um interested some of you probably skipped through this part but if you didn't i really do hope that this prayer helps you because i do have a great feeling that this month of may is going to be great and this prayer also just assured me of it so ready to see what may have in store for me. I need to get finished getting ready though. I don't even know what I'm gonna wear tonight, but we'll see. Probably one of the things I got from Zara and mixed with something else, we'll see. So I actually got these pants before I left the States and this is the top that I got from Zara today. So I'm thinking I'm going to wear this top with these pants and those earrings that I also got from Zara and this jacket that I also got from Zara. So we shall see how tonight's outfit goes. I also got these boots from Zara a while back. Clearly I love Zara but you can never go wrong with them. Cause I don't think I did something. So I think I'm gonna go back to the drawing board. Like I'm in another country and I'm here to snatch some yetis. So yeah, I'm going back to the drawing board. I need to be a bad bitch. Fuck that. Okay, okay. Did the drawing board do the drawing? I don't know. I'm gonna wear these. I need some black. I need something black up here. I don't know what. And I don't know how. Maybe a scarf? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I need something black at the top though. Let me see if it's jagged. But the jacket is brown and mixing this together with black is kind of crazy. But it's still cute though. I'm fucked up by a little shorty. Hold a nigga down and she took my Glock 40. Like this could definitely be a vibe. A 
gonna be like this. Bow, 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 bow. I'm kidding. I don't know if they be dancing like that out here. But this is kind of cute. Like, she could definitely be a vibe still. I think maybe. I gotta. Let me see. I gotta look at my phone camera. Any honest opinions? I need honest opinions. So, outfit number one. Outfit number one. Mind you, only have these out here because, yeah, long story, but yeah. So, yeah, outfit number one. Hold on. Y'all, why is my straightener not working? Like, the straightener, I think because the plugs in here, I don't know what it is, but the plugs in the wall, it's not connecting like it's connecting but the straightener is not getting hot it's getting warm but not hot i don't know what to do uh oh i could iron there's iron should i use iron i don't know what to do because what the fuck what the fuck like what the fuck this is not good it's not okay so i went back to the drawing board once again, so I went back to the drawing board once again. This was first saw the plan fit for for here. I want to put these little bows on the legs though. So, and at first I wanted to save this outfit to take pictures during the day, but we're literally about to take pictures. Like I'm going to have somebody to actually take them rather than asking a stranger. So I'm just going to take them today. So yeah. Hello? Hey, are you guys here? You Do you want me to come downstairs? I don't know. We can't hear you, hey. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? No, we can't hear you. What about now? Just, just. I'm gonna come downstairs. Downstairs. I'm about to Google Translate. <laughs> Hello, thank you guys for inviting me out and doing this video with me. Let's turn up. <laughs> for some, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. For some reason, my straightener was not getting warm. I mean, it was literally just, I don't know. Pictures, pictures, like my mother. She said, fuck my baby. Fuck my baby. She said she don't understand the words, but she know that part. Fuck my baby, daddy. my baby. Hello, my fille. Bonjour, on veut on vient de Bruxelles. Oui, bonjour. One, two, bonjour. three. Bonjour.
gotta be careful. Y'all, why is it 5 51? 6 a.m. 6 a.m. Let's see what time it is in LA and Texas. Hold on. Because they be they be having a ball out here. I cannot hang. I really can't. And it's crazy because in Houston and LA, oh I'm big gang. I'm big hanging. But out here, it's till 6 a.m. That's crazy. Honestly, I can go to 6 a.m. in the States, but we go from different places. They stay in one place till 6 a.m. And then go to a whole after hour after that. But it's not like after hour after hour, like in the States. Like, it's not like a hookah lounge or a strip club. They go to like a house party or something like that. I saw them, I said, is there food there? That was my first question. They said no. So you see where I'm going. I'm on the way home. Well, to the hotel. To the telly. I'm on the way to the telly. But yeah. They got it. If it was food there, they definitely could have convinced me. I definitely would have been on the way. But if there's no food at the after hour or wherever the fuck I'm going, you can count me out. You can count me the fuck out. I forgot to tell y'all what time it was in LA, in Houston. It's 10.52 in Houston and 8.52 in LA. 8.52 p.m. is so crazy. The next day. Another day, another dollar. No, one. I'm not playing. Why I gotta say I'm playing when I'm not playing? I'm not fucking playing. But it's the last day in Brussels. And I just literally woke up like an hour ago. It's 6 p.m. here. I woke up at like 5 something. But mind you, I did not go to sleep until like 9 a.m. So that has a lot to do with it. But since it's my last day and I didn't see any architecture or anything, I'm going to do that today. I'm trying to rush before like the sun really, really goes down. It's not like gone down completely. Like it's still there a little. Like. It's like still a little there. So we're trying to hurry up. I literally, my wig is literally falling off the bone. Like, I honestly, yeah, it's horrible. But I'm not gonna put on any makeup. I'm gonna do with some lashes. I'm gonna do some lashes. Um, and yeah. My wig, like I said, is falling off the bone. So I'm going to, I don't have a hat. I meant to. I meant to find a hat while I was out here and I did not. But I'm gonna make something shake. I'm either gonna put a scarf on or something. I'm going to see this architecture. I'm going up this mountain to save my marriage. But I don't know what this is all about. But I'm going up this mountain to save my marriage. I'm going to go see this um, architecture literally just for y'all. Just so I can add it to the vlog, literally, because I don't give up about no architecture but I mean I still want to go and I'm also going for pictures and stuff too even though I'm gonna look crazy because like I said falling off the bone it's kind of crazy it's honestly crazy but y'all it was so hot in that damn club it was so hot it was literally and it was so many people I didn't even know they had that many people out here and they were all young too. I was so happy to see so many young people and like, it was cool. I feel so loved. Like literally I feel so loved. Everybody was so welcoming and like, it just was honestly amazing. Like I met friends out here and honestly, like when we were leaving each other last night, we were like, I love you, I love you. Like, I literally love them. Like, they literally, oh my gosh, I keep saying literally, but I'm so serious. Like, love them down. They honestly, uh, they felt like sisters. Like, it was just so good. <sighs> I'm just overjoyed right now because everywhere I go, I'm loved and and I love where I go. Like, I can't really explain it, but like, it's just literally, it's crazy. 
Like, I'm thankful for the people that I met. Like, wow, my trip would not have been the same if I didn't meet them. And it was just really crazy and amazing. I need to find something to put on my head, y'all. Okay, we got the lashes on. I know I said I was gonna do no makeup, but I do wanna add some blush because it just a little goes a long way with blush. And I hate that I've become a blush girl because I literally love it too much. Like I love it too much. Like at first I was like, I can't go anywhere without highlight. But now it's like, I can't go without blush. I love me some blush. And especially this liquid blush. Oh my gosh. It does the trick every time. And it looks like I'm just woken up. Like I'm just so alive and so sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you mean? Wow. I really leave tomorrow. They all ask me to stay another week, but I'm like, who's gonna pay for my hotel? <laughs> okay. Um, I'm talking about no makeup, but we gonna do a little, cause now I want some highlight too. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Wow, wow. Look what that little bit did, like, wow. Wow. All right, um, what am I gonna put on my head? This is like something that I wore last night. It's actually like a tube dress, but I'm gonna put it on my head because, because yeah. I'm literally just so resourceful and like inventive. Like period, period, do you feel me? Like, wow, it got this little thing in the back, but who cares, wow, it's still cute. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, I gotta go, because the sun is going down. I need to pack, Um, I need to pack a, I need to pack my purse. For the earrings, ah. earrings, necklace. Um, um. Oh gosh, please hurry up, honey. So there's a girl that had the same purse as me last night. I was just imagining like, oh my gosh, what if we like, accidentally took each other's purses and we left and then we were both across the world and I would it would just have been too much my passport was in there like it just would have been crazy that was just like a what if moment in my head um I definitely should probably bring a jacket I don't even know the weather but just in case okay um purse I need to put my camera both batteries because yeah they keep dying okay put on some lip liner all right i'm about to call the car i'm gonna come back to y'all once i'm in the vehicle this outfit actually turned out really cute i'm actually kind of not mad at it pants from marshall's jacket from zara top from zara yeezy pods Easy pods, and then I'm, this is not, this of course wasn't supposed to be like this, but it, I like it. Like damn, she need her move. 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 She lit, your money too. Like damn, she need her move. In the mirror, I'm doing my dance. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. It's so unfortunate I don't have anyone to take my picture, but I had someone 
I just asked a couple and they were so nice and they took them. I'm gonna put them right here. Heaven, my name is Heaven. What's your name? Zara. Zara. Nice to meet you. This is my new friend, guys. Hello. Hello there. <laughs> so nice adorable. to meet you. <laughs> How do you like? Do you, are you from here? No, I'm from Slovakia. Okay. <laughs> How do you like Belgium? I love it. It's beautiful. I love the history. Yeah. It is so beautiful. <laughs> You're very beautiful. You are really beautiful. Look at you. You are. <laughs> Queen, thank you. Stunning. Wow. Oh, you, that's you, your goddess. Thank you so much, Sarah. Thank you. You know, I guess you can be my friend for the day if you want. Yeah, I love to. <laughs> They must be from, I wonder where they're from. That's amazing. <laughs> Everything like that. Really? Yeah. They have like so many people like this dancing on the streets of America. Oh wow. Yeah. I'd love to visit America one day. Yeah, you should visit. Um, I'd love to. I will. I will. Hopefully. <laughs> well. How long is your flight to, um... Your... No, we aren't going by a plane, we are going by a boat. Okay, okay, okay. Aww. Frozen yogurt in Belgium. This is from Obi. And I also have a waffle, a Belgian waffle. So let's do the frozen yogurt first. Oh my gosh. So good, it's so tasteful. I did strawberry and vanilla. I'm whispering because I'm in a very nice establishment and I don't want to be loud but 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 now let's try the Belgian waffle that they're famous for chocolate I got milk chocolate Oh my god. Oh my god. This is by far my favorite part. My favorite food that I've had here so far. This and the pizza. Oh my gosh. Don't have to see. I already love strawberry ice cream, strawberry cake, strawberry milkshakes. This is really topping it. Everyone talks about how good Belgian waffles are. They are really good. But this frozen yogurt, to die for. I know I've said it already, but 10 out of 10. I feel so big back here. So my back is expanding. 
This being my first meal of the day is insane. been a great vlog I leave tomorrow it's nice knowing everyone okay I can't really be serious because everybody's staring at me right now fuck the police without that badge they a bitch in the streets nah I'm playing it's like not nah, I don't know these people we don't want no smoke we don't want no problems came to the souvenir shop to get friends Things. This is pretty. So I want to show you guys what I got at the gift shop for me and my friends and family. So I just got shot glasses and like refrigerator magnetics. Um, this was the shot glass I got myself. It has like sparkles and it says Brussels, Belgium. I really like it. It's really the sparkles for me that I love. Um, and it was also the last one there. So I was like, it's meant to be. And it's, it has pink and let alone sparkles. Like that just says enough. And then these are the ones that I got my friends. I got them all the same one because I just did not feel like debating which one, which one. And plus, this is something that I know my friends would like. And this is also the statue of Brussels. It's like a little boy peeing. <laughs> Hold on. It's a little boy, oh, it's a little boy peeing. And yes, um, I have how many of these? I have one, two, three, four, five. Every time I go to another country, I do like, even another city, I do like to get a shot glass as a souvenir. Like my cabinet has like shot glasses from New York, Cabo, London, Jamaica, and now in Brussels. And then I also got these magnetics for my um, family on the fr on for their fridge. It's just like that is so pretty. And this is like the city, not the city, but this is actually the same thing. So where I just was just now, this is where I just was at the Grand Palace, and someone was telling me that this thing they do like these flowers on the pavement is so beautiful it happens every other year they did it in 2022 and then they did it in 2024 wait so it's happening this year it's happening again this year and then i'm assuming the next one is 2026 and then 2028 and so on but wow hopefully i'm here for that because i actually do want to come back here everyone all the people I've met, they're like, they're like, Brussels is shit, Brussels is shit. Like they hate, they hate it. But I'm like, I honestly had a great time with all of you guys. Like I literally had so much fun. I can't see myself living here. Unfortunately, it's too slow for me. And also I'm just not a fan of all the food. Like I like to eat and I like like a lot of unhealthy things. And yeah, but. It was still great. I had a ball. I leave tomorrow morning and back to the state. Now I'm about to just sit in bed, edit, 
and look through all the pictures that I've taken. I really do wanna post my Belgium pictures today and then again tomorrow, fingers crossed. But yeah, we shall see. The next time I talk to you guys, I will be probably either at the airport on the way to the airport or I might go out for dinner tonight, but it's literally 9.25. And most places are first off not open on a Sunday and today is Sunday and then others they're closing at 10 and it's 9 25 so I would literally have to go somewhere right now and I'm not in the mood for anything specific I really the only thing specifically I'm in the mood for is sushi like I really want some yellow tail and stuff but I'm like maybe I should just wait to go to like Tower Nobu when I get back because <coughs> I don't want to get it and then I'm disappointed I feel like I'm just gonna chill and then probably order McDonald's later tonight until my flight tomorrow. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I had so much fun making it. And I hope you guys, if you're planning on visiting Brussels, Belgium, I hope this video found itself to you because I feel like I did a lot of great informational things on here. I don't know, maybe I did, maybe I didn't, I don't know. But it was still a fun vlog. And that's all that counts. So love you guys, love fish and grease. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video so this video can reach other people that need to see how the vibes are in Brussels, Belgium. So yeah, like, comment, subscribe. We are on the way on the road to 100K. I love you angels so much and cheers. Ciao to many more videos, bye. Mansion out in the sticks with nothing around you. Katie, Texas, Dallas, Texas, you know a different environment. Thank you. You got desires? I know, I know. You got desires?